I shouted and I kicked, but there were two of them. And it was him letting the Vic? They had a hold of me. If they, if they hadn't got scared and thought someone might hear me screaming and run off, then anything could have happened. Yeah, but it didn't, I didn't. No, but it could have. They hit me out hard and... Oh, it hurt so look, look, do you want me to go and phone the old Bill? No. Well, because if them blokes did rough you <laughs> up, you then you know. What do you mean if? Do you think I did this to myself? I mean, why would I make something like this up? Please, you're just like him. Terry. No, 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 I never meant no, it like that. I don't want to know. I went to him, I was hurt, and he, he d just slammed the door on me. He didn't believe me. Why would I make something like this up, Gary? You believe me, don't you? Don't you? Please tell me you believe me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course oh, I do, babe. Thank you. I believe you, I believe you. Oh. Anyway, sorry. You ring her friends and see if she's there for some numbers here. Do you think most don't run her over this Donna thing? Well, it's serving right if she has. Not anything good about until we just get ringing, yeah? Right. I'll get you a coffee, and then I'll best be off. You're going to leave me? I'll, you'll be fine. Gary, please, can't you just stay for a bit? No, I'm sorry, I've got to get to work. I'm late as it is. Coffee, please, uh, beautiful. You two look nice and cosy. Well, I've been trying to get a shot of her. Really? Yeah, came round my ass at the crack of dawn saying some blokes had roughed her up. And had they? Nah. She just had a fallout with Terry, that's all. Wants a bit of sympathy. Oh. Well, why don't you take her to Skegness? That should cheer her up. How long is this honeymoon thing going to go on for, babe? I said I'm sorry. Look, let's go out tonight, eh? I'll bring some holiday brochures around. What do you say? 60 pence, please. Hello. Oh, yeah. A coffee, please. Are you getting anything for your little friend there? What? An Oscar? <laughs> Bo's back. She looks all right. Where's she been? I don't know. Trevor got to her before I did. Is she mad or something? Why is she even talking to him? She needs her head examined. Do we should go around there now? No, I'll go around later. All right. See yourself. Still show time, is it, Janine? It's hurt. All right. Well, let's go to casualty. Come on. If you've been hurt, we'll get someone to fix it, shall we? For me, Terry, I don't want to. That's because there's nothing wrong and there is nothing to see, is there? Uh, what's going on? Oh, uh, it's all right. Janine's just on her way to the hospital. Why do you not believe me? Because I know the way your twisted little mind works. No, you don't, Terry. You don't know me at all. If you did, you'd have... What? Looked after me and helped me. I've done nothing but help you, Janine, and I have had enough. You can't stand to see anyone happy, can you? You're a taker. Oh. You're a parasite. She's looking for Pauline. She's just popped out. Shh. What are you hiding from? Life. You shouldn't be drinking that. To call the police. Have you got any left? Mate, do you think you could deliver these somewhere else? Hold on a minute, mate. It's my birthday today. My birthday? Guess how old I am. Forty-three? <laughs> no, no, forty. Sorry, Barry. I'm not very good with people ages. Especially people over 30. I mean, Terry, he's over 50. Is he really? Yeah, well, you'd have thought that being that age, you'd have had some, I don't know, sense. You know, and after everything I've done for him, I've run his poxy little business, listened to him whining about his problems. Do you, do you think my name suits me? Barry? Yeah. See, I've, I've always reckoned myself to be more of a, a Steve or a Dave. Oh. I reckon it suits you. It's Barry. It's you. What do people think of me, Janine? What? Well, when they talk about me, what do they say? You know, well, look, there goes Barry. He's a right... I don't know. Well, what words do they use to describe me? Fat, bald, oh, loser? Oh, no, Barry, they never use bald. Oh, great. What do you care what people around here think, anyway? No, you're right. Mm -hmm. You're right. Family's all that matters. <laughs> yeah. What do they think of me? I don't 
doesn't matter. I bet they'd be there for you if you was ever in trouble. Yeah. Vodka and tonic, please, Trace, and they'll be on the vodka. You were meant to look out for me, Terry, my big mate. You don't even care, do you? Like you cared about me. She was cheating on you. <laughs> she made me happy. Make you happy, Terry. I'll go home, Janine, you're drunk. Don't you turn your back on me! Do you know what this man did? My friend, Terry Raymond. Me, right? A young girl. I've been attacked by two blokes and I came to you for help. Play acting, more like. What do you want me to do? Show you the proof? Oh, you I'll show you Take you yourself home. Oh, God. God. Shut the door on me, Terry. I was shaking. I was crying and I was so scared. And you just turned away. Go home, Janine. I hope you can live with yourself. Go on, Janine. Go, on. Go home, darling. Go on. One minute. Where are you going? Everything all right? Yeah. Are you going to tell him or shall I? No, yeah. What's going on? We're going to have a baby. Well, try for one anyway. Can you please for me? Janine! <gasps> Sorry. Oh, come on, love. Let's get you home. Come on. Come on. It's all right. It's all right. Come on. 